It's a simple little gadget that we take for granted every day. But the truth of the matter is that life without clothing hangers would be very wrinkled. Every year, millions and millions of hangers get tossed in the bin and eventually end up in landfills. Last year, 20 million clothing hangers were diverted from landfills by Hangerman, a company that reuses and recycles hangers, which was co-founded by Tom McLaughlin as part of the Woolworths Good Business Journey. Tom, I love my clothes and I make sure that I hang them up to keep them neat. But I had no idea that so many hangers were being thrown out, which eventually ends up polluting the environment. Well, we saw that problem many years ago and what we did is um, we created a system so that they could be reused and if they couldn't be reused, they could be recycled. So in 1985, Hanger Man was born. It collects the hangers from the stores, the ones that you don't want. You give it back to Woolworths. They ensure it gets to Hangerman. Hangerman sorts the hangers and sends them out to places like Orion, where we are today. And the people at Orion clean them, wash them, pack them, and they get back to the clothing factories and they get reused. 250 million hangers have already gone through Orion since it started, and um, they do a tremendous job. Thousands of unwanted hangers are collected from stores each week and brought to the Hangerman factory, where they receive a new lease on life. Once hangers arrived, they firstly need to be sorted by type. From there they go to packers who take off the stickers, check that the hooks are all shiny, check that the hangers are not broken. Some of those hangers also go to workshops where they employ people who are living with disabilities. Once they are packed into a hangerman box, we're able to sell them back to clothing manufacturers. Every month we collect 60 to 80 tons of hangers nationally. And since 1986, when Hanger Man was started, we have processed almost 600 million hangers, of which 375 million have been successfully recycled for reuse. Along with the environmental benefits, the project also supports the Orion organization by providing jobs and skills development for those living with physical and mental disabilities. It doesn't only give them something to do, but it also creates a feeling of worthiness, self-respect, dignity, and they grow. They grow within themselves and they grow towards people around them. They take pride in, in, in doing a job that's of help and assistance to other people and can actually add to the income of the family. Atlantis resident Claudine Barron was born with an intellectual disability and has been with Orion organization for more than 20 years. One of our success stories, Claudine, she's doing this now since she left school and presently she's actually creating an income for her family. She lives with her parents and by doing this job, she's creating work for herself, creating an income. Mm -hmm. When I come and work here for my first year, it was so nice. Of course, I can see I can work here for the people, me included. And I can see the difference when I was sick here, my come and working here, they place my whole life changed. But I was also lonely and I got ill. And then I come here and this place, I changed my life. And it gives them work, it gives them something better than work, it gives them self-respect and dignity. It's so wonderful to know that here your clothing hangers are being reused and recycled, but more importantly, they're passing through hands that are being empowered.